Today, Cable Bahamas inked a contract with Bahamian international recording artist and entertainer Angelique Sabrina. The agreement makes the young music star the new face and voice of the country's only triple play telecommunications company, providing cable TV, telephone, and broadband internet services. At just 15 years old, Angelique Sabrina has already made her mark on the music industry. Veteran radio industry executive Gary Bernstein revealed the scope of Angelique Sabrina's impact and reach in the major markets of the United States. The tough thing about this industry right now is you have a lot of people that are put on a pedestal and the representation that they give to the world is not the best for the kids. Um, right now when we put Angelique up on a pedestal, you know, everybody in the Bahamas can be proud that she stands for something that all the kids can look up to. So for me, I'm excited to be here. I wouldn't miss it. I think that Cable Bahamas made an amazing strategic alliance. I think they're highly innovative. You know, and I, 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 Angelique and where she's going, I mean, the sky's the limit. Everywhere I go, everybody want to know, tell me, tell me, tell me, who is she? Stop and when I hit the floor, they be feeling one more, stop and shot, suck the paparazzi. Stop when asked what benefits Cable Bahamas would see from this new relationship, Cable Bahamas head of marketing, David Burrows, noted that Cable Bahamas is a young, innovative company and that working with Angelique Sabrina is fitting from where the company is at this time. We're a young company. We our innovative company. We are a revolutionary company. Uh, what It's essential because we are on uh, the cutting edge. We are, um, we've just increased our broadband speeds by 500%. Um, we've just changed our ranking in the world for broadband speeds from 87th. I'm talking about the Bahamas, not Cable Bahamas, the Bahamas, the country itself, from 87th to 45 in the matter of a month. Um, uh, we have changed the landscape of the country in terms of communications. So it is most fitting that we have someone like Angelique, someone who is young, someone who can uh, identify and connect with uh, the young people in the country uh, as well, because this technology is the future of the country, and so is Angelique. Angelique has the regular involvement of her family, in particular her father, who was also her manager and producer, Greg White. Mr. White said the motivation behind Angelique's work is not what many people expect it to be. It has really been Angelique's incredible work ethic, her drive towards excellence and towards improving her craft and getting to where she wants to get as a voice. And it, it's, it's never been fame or fortune, the types of things that you tr traditionally think entertainers are interested in. She's never really been interested in the fame fortune side of the business. Her, her, her interest is that she has something internal that she wants to communicate and express. Angelique Sabrina has worked throughout the United States, recording her work, performing live on stage, and making the connection she needs to develop her career. But she says she will remain connected to the Bahamas and is happy about the support she has been getting. I'm an island girl first. I was born and raised in the Bahamas. The past couple of months, maybe year, I've been traveling a lot um, abroad in the States, but it, it, there's no, there's no um, disconnection. I'm, a, I'm an island girl and I always feel most comfortable when I come back home. I actually was very surprised. I, wasn't, I was taken back by the embrace that I got here. I wasn't expecting First of all, for people to love the fact that I, I do what I love so much. People are very, um, they, they're proud when they see someone, especially in their own country, doing what they love. And they kind of want to be a part of it. So I was kind of taken back by how much support I've been getting. Um, it's been a lot, and it's kind of overwhelming for me, but I'm glad that people are you know, liking what I do. When asked how people respond when she gets criticism, especially online, Angelique said that Bahamians always come to her defense. If someone says something on YouTube, the Bahamians come and they're like, look, this girl from the 242, okay? Don't do it, boo boo. I was like, woo! Stop, 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 stop. Recognizing that there are many pressures facing artists in the music industry, Mr. Bernstein said that Angelique Sabrina is working from a solid foundation. The strong family backing that she has, that's one of the reasons why I don't see her wavering. I mean, I mean, in this industry, you have to work hard. You got to be humble. You've got to be passionate. You got to be creative. And most artists, when they get big, they become a different person, you know. And then they lose themselves. You know, I don't see Angelique losing herself. And I think a lot of that's because of the family backing. 
Mr. Burroughs made it clear that today's signing of Angelique Sabrina as a positive and youthful representative of Cable Bahamas was something the entire company is looking forward to. It's fantastic. I think it's great. And Cable Bahamas is very, very happy to have you as part of our family. Thank you.